The IAM Family Day splashed into its fourth year at the William W. Wimpesinger Education and Technology Center in Hollywood, Maryland. Employees and their families gathered for a day off in the sun or the shade for a picnic, fun, and fellowship. Brothers and sisters, ladies and gentlemen, family members, it's an honor to have you here today to join us at the Wimpesinger Center for our annual family gathering. It was a chance to spend time with those who fight for labor rights all year long. Familiar faces making new friends, all in the name of solidarity. Retired International President George Corpus and retired General Secretary Treasurer Don Wharton were on hand for a special rededication of the Corpus Room on the third floor of the Wimpesinger Center, full of photos and mementos of George's time leading the IAM from 1989 to 1997. George. We want you and your family to know that this union has never forgotten and still deeply appreciates the work you did. International President Corpus has been a mentor to me for the last 16 years, has guided, has guided me through a number of very tough issues and very difficult situations, and he remains a good friend and a mentor. Newly retired General Secretary Treasurer Robert Roach also had a conference room dedicated in his name at the Wimpesinger Center, highlighting his accomplishments, partnerships, and memorabilia from his early days at TWA to his final days at the IAM at the end of July. And we want to share that, not just with the few that are here, but with all the members from this day forward who come through the Wimpesinger Center to learn how to be better trade unionists and to go out and practice it. Practice it so our children and grandchildren will reap the benefits of all the hard work and dedication the IAM puts into its fight for working families everywhere. For the Machinist News Network, I'm Tanya Hutchins.